All right, here we're looking at something really rare. This is in 1964, the last year they made them. Studebaker Hawk GT Gran Turismo Supercharged. My gosh, this is one of the rarest birds that you're going to see anywhere. That was an R2 uh, that came with the 289. Uh, this is a 289 with custom line covers on it, and it has a uh, McCullough supercharger. So it's an original it. equipment Studebaker right. setup. So the, as far as we know. Yeah. It's a four, factory four-speed. It's a beautiful car. It runs great. Straight. Yeah. They need paint. I mean, it's, uh, this paint is as old as the car. And the interior is in nice shape. I mean, this car needs very little to make it uh, to make it exquisite. And uh, I think they'd have something there. It's got nice radial tires on it, which certainly are better than the old four-ply bias. But I love that engine. It sounds great. Let me start it up for you. This is one that I can throw a nice paint job on it, take it to any show, and you know, take home a prize. Man, that's tight. Sounds good. Do you know off the top of your head how many four-speed cars they made of these GTs? They made about 70 of them. And uh, supposedly there's only 40, we maybe 40 uh, four-speeds in existence left. You know, and this one's a runner. Yeah. So uh, there's not very many. Uh, it's in the uh, Studebaker registry. The number on it is 64VKB. 879. Nice. We made 1,400 of the cars originally, and very few four speeds, and very few, you know. Supercharged yeah, four speeds. Yeah, this, this interior is pretty nice, Doc. This car's a sleeper. Yep, interior's really nice. Yeah. And that's all original, right? Yep. Wow. We got that nice new... Uh, that new trunk, you know, versus the old one, yeah. they had the stainless steel on it.